Hey everyone, Adam here from Adam Fiasco Productions. I hope you're doing really well. In this video, I'm gonna be talking about mindset and how that relates to you as a musician, focusing on something called confirmation bias. Now, confirmation bias is a really well-researched area of psychology. And put very simply, it states that people will always favor knowledge or seek out information that aligns with their previously held beliefs. And this is something that is so powerful that it can either propel you forward, help you smash your goals and ultimately give you the life of your dreams or it can hold you back or even worse, completely destroy you and tear you down. My aim for this video is to make you aware of what it is and how you can basically reprogram your mind so that you can use confirmation bias to your advantage. Now confirmation bias goes hand in hand with something called synchronicity. A good example of this that you might be familiar with is when you want to buy a new car. Chances are you've chosen the make and the model of the car that you want. You might have even chosen the finer details, things like the colour. And when you've made that decision, you start to notice that car everywhere. Every time you step foot out of the house or go for a drive, you see the car that you have made the decision to buy. You might even say to yourself, it's a sign. But the reality of the situation is you are just more aware of that car now because you formed an emotional connection with it. So every time you see it, you take notice. So how does this relate to music? Well, if you are constantly telling yourself that you're not good enough, that no one will come to your shows, people don't like you, people don't value music anymore, well, you will always find information that confirms that belief to you. Let's imagine you release a single and it doesn't get the traction that you want it to. You will say to yourself, the reason that your single hasn't been a success is because you're not good enough. People don't value music anymore. When the reality is, it's probably something else that you are unconsciously choosing to ignore. There are people out there who will value your music. It's entirely possible to make a living from your music, if that's something that you want to do. It's also entirely possible to work your way up to bigger and better shows and to go on tour. Because there are people that would love to come and see you live. Now, if you start telling yourself these things and really start believing it, and if you start hanging out with people with the same beliefs and talking to people who are doing the very thing that you want to do, then you will start to reprogram your mindset and you will seek new information that confirms it. Now, when you reprogram your mind and you have a more positive way of thinking, this is often when the solutions to your problems and the actions that you need to take become much clearer. You'll start to realise that the reason your last release wasn't as successful and didn't get the traction that you wanted is because you didn't do X, Y or Z. Not because of the rubbish you were telling yourself before. Now I realise that this may seem a bit out there and you might be thinking it's all snake oil, especially if this is new to you. However, confirmation bias is a very real thing and you can Google it for yourself and see all of the papers that have been published on it. A mindset is probably the biggest factor in determining your success. Now I hope this video has been of value to you and you've benefited from it. I hope you've learned something. Make sure that you join us in the Label Worthy Facebook group where we have tons of discussions from music production to marketing to mindset. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a great day.